friends, good morning. Emily Vigel around again. And today I present you a very interesting new trick. I hope it's interesting for you, as it was for me, because I had no idea how to eat, really enjoy a grenade, a pom grenade, you see. But before I do this today, make sure it won't give me a lot of trouble with my laundry. And uh, the very first thing I do is a light, flip my light. I have a candle here. See, because today is Deepavali in India, and Indians all around the globe celebrate this wonderful fest festival of lights. Many parts of India, mostly in the north, they celebrate the, the beginning of the new year. So it is connected with a new moon, that means a um, new start, beginning something new, symbolically of course. And, um, but yeah, the Indians, they are masters in celebrating happiness, you know. And yeah, I like that so much. And my yoga master in India, Kali Ray from Tree Yoga, she does that too. And um, yeah, I enjoy it. Today, I want to show you something about a pomegranate. It is an ancient fruit, one of the most ancient ones, and known to be cultivated. For example, the figs, the grapes, and the uh, uh, olives have been cultivated have been known to be cultivated since the three or four thousand years before Christ even. So together with this one. So it has to be a very important and there are many tales about it, many uh, myths, but you know for sure there's a lot of vitamin A, C and E in it and folic acid, so it's very healthy and it's also known to help your blood to run in a very easy way. So there's very very many many uh, health benefits known to this and um, many stories told, but just, I, I want to show you something. I love it a lot. Yes, I have a lot of um, fun experience with that. Very crucial ones too. But um, today I want to show you just a simple freak, trick how to enjoy this in a wonderful way. And it is, um, it's very easy really. You don't need any tool, almost. But you just need to have some time. Time and two hands, because you need to press to knead this, like I do here. You see? You listen? You listen? What happens? When I push it like this, little kernels inside. There are many little kernels inside, looking like gel or glass or something. They crack open and they release a most delicious juice. And in case you're not so fortunate and this breaks open while you do it right, some juice comes out of it. You cannot go on because you have to, um, you need the, in the integrity of the whole skin of the fruit. So you make sure, if you want to do this, you have a fruit that is really perfectly um, unblemished. And then you can go on doing this. And um, I quickly have to tell you from where I got this trick. It's so amazing. A friend of mine, it now it's a friend of mine, became a, she became a friend of mine. She is selling flowers and beautiful plants not far from my house, my apartment in Berlin. And I used to go there for some time when I noticed um, she was doing yoga for decades already, even longer than I was. So I started a conversation with her about that and um, then we began to exchange useful tricks and tips, tips and tricks and so on. And once she, she, she told me she was a Jew, was Jewish, and oh folks, they have many, many uh, useful tricks. They come from an ancient culture, you know, the Jews, Jews they, have, they are the biblical people. So they are very ancient, one of our ancient um, people here in the West, and, uh, and they used to do this, always. They press the pomegranate and poke a little hole into it, and then just drink it with a straw. I had never heard that before, so I had to try. And believe me, sometimes 
I tried it for some times because I love the pomegranate and sometimes it didn't work out so <laughs> some waters, some juice uh, came out and um, fortunately I wasn't hit by it because otherwise you have to cleanse your t-shirt. Uh, yeah, probably that has a dark red, if it's a really ripe and good one, a sweet one, is a dark uh, red, crimson red. It's beautiful, the color, and uh, yes, it's um, it's most amazing. So I will now, I won't show you the whole process. I could go on telling you stories about pomegranates, my life with a pomegranate, and my friends, and so on, and so on. But I simply will come back when I'm done, and then I'll show you how I will drink it with a straw. So, see you in a couple of minutes. Here I am again, always kneading and massaging my beautiful pomegranate. You see, I show you, I have to show you this, it's so amazing. You see, yeah, my hands have been busy all the time, this way. In the first, you will hear the little crooks, the little kernels, which are at the outside, what that do. But then, you need a lot of patience to get to the inside. There are kernels deep inside, in the center. How would you get those? So you have to really be persistent and really always do this kind of kneading. I've been doing this now for more than 15 minutes without pause. And uh, it's like a meditation. And you have to be careful not to open the skin like it does begins here. You see the skin begins to open. Now go on, it might poke open, a scratch clash open and the whole thing will be finished. So be very careful. Oh, and you already begin to feel the liquid inside, the water. It begins to sweat out, very little, but you feel it. You feel the coldness. It is such an amazing experience. I tell you, it's more than a meditation. But then uh, really working on a, on, a, on, a, on a palm grenade. It's really nice. Now I will finish this because I guess this one won't allow me to go on for longer. And I will poke a little hole inside. See, little hole, little knife, little straw, and then I will drink it. Just here. See, whoa, already comes out. Very careful. It runs out of itself. Mmm. Just press a little bit and the water comes out. It's my straw. Try it yourself, and I tell you, you gotta master this. This is something for patience. Patience. And if you want, you can do your yogic breathing, your rhythmic breathing in between. Like you, you inhale fully, you fill your lungs to the maximum capacity, through all the three layers lower, middle, upper, and then you exhale. On its own at first, and the end of the exhalation, you squeeze your tummy in to get all the air out. And then you go on in this meditative process. You will follow your breath on your way inside of yourself. And meanwhile, you keep on needing this beautiful, refreshing, super healthy fruit. Now, I'm on my way to celebrate the deep valley. With this and a start, what can go wrong? Have a wonderful one. See you soon. One more tip. If you have a little bowl and the hole is poked open and you got some juice out of it, the straw, then you could also continue to turn it around like this, you see. Squeeze the whole juice 
out of that hole. And you have this wonderful juice. Most delicious pomegranate juice, just freshly squeezed. Mm. Wow. Yeah. Bye-bye. <laughs>